From all angles, Yellowstone is a distinct environment. You know when you're there. But approaching from the north, it is more obvious than you might expect. Marking the only year-round automotive access to the park, the Roosevelt Arch is your northern starting point to the journey of Yellowstone. Entering the park from the north, traveling from the gateway town of Gardner to the thermal zone of Norris, you'll find the first of many geological attractions, a spot where the icy cold waters of the Gardner River meet the warm flow of the boiling river. Mammoth offers an array of historic buildings alongside modern lodges. As park headquarters, it is the home to Yellowstone's year-round residents, both the two- and four-legged varieties. Elk are regularly seen grazing on the grounds here. As you approach the area known as the Golden Gate, the road marks the path of early stagecoach routes into the park. Thankfully, contemporary engineering makes for a substantially less harrowing journey. Named for the ancient indigenous tribes that made their way around Yellowstone country, Sheep Eater Cliff is a striking rock outcropping. The Native Americans hunted along the tops of these cliffs. Today, the tradition is carried on by Yellowstone's current inhabitants. The fumaroles of Roaring Mountain make an enticing stop on your journey. Clouds rise from the otherworldly landscape and you glimpse further into Yellowstone's secrets, experiencing its magic firsthand.